Welcome to Bosnia Herzegovina. So, so Felicia was taught to never throw food out, okay? Feld, do you remember our saying today? We have a saying today. Do you remember what it was? Umbrellas are so stupid. No matter rain or shine, we'll have a great time. Right? <laughs> yeah. And it's interesting because you can see mosques and churches all, all together. We're on the bridge now, the popular bridge that you see everywhere in photos here. And it's called Stari Most, which means old bridge. And Mostari, I think, means bridge keeper. And so that's where the city gets the name, I suppose. But from here you can see the mosque where we were before. Right? Over there. In that little, whatever you call it, balcony. We're a bit more awake now that we've had coffee. But I failed at my first Turkish coffee attempt. Felicia ordered homemade coffee at this nice restaurant here. I don't know what to do with it. I think, Phil, just try pouring it. I think the coffee is at the bottom, so just pour it in. I should have asked. What is going on? Oh, there it is. And then I let it set. What do you do? I think I just let it sit for a bit. I don't know. I think I failed. Like I got a little bit of the, the grain. So do not stir that coffee. You gotta let it sit. And we're looking at our notes from our host. Yesterday we were so excited after he gave us a little tour that we're like, oh my god, it's gonna be awesome. Today we're looking at the map and it's just a bunch of scribbles. <laughs> no, <laughs> we don't really remember everything. So we're trying to make sense of the scribbles and the X's, but I think we're on the right track. Behind me you can see the um, the old bridge, like the, uh, it's kind of like the test bridge for when they were building the, the big popular bridge. So we're gonna walk around, show you guys more of Mostar. So two hours has gone by and I'm still holding these things we bought this morning. And this is chicken, eh? I don't believe Felicia's gonna eat them, but we're still holding them. She, do she doesn't know I'm talking about her. What did you say? <laughs> what did you say? What? Did you drop them or something? No, I didn't think you were going to eat them. It's like one of those things where you just didn't want to throw away food. I thought it would be rude. A little bit greasy. But you don't want any? <laughs> A little bit gross. You're just making fun of me, eh? So we've, we've never done like 360 video or anything like that. Um, to me, it's like a novelty. And like, I didn't know, but my phone can take, like it takes like pictures. Your phone might be able to do this too. I took like pictures, like, I don't know if it's like 30 pictures like this, and eventually made a 360, 360 image. My, I just cracked my screen the other day, and it made a 360 image like really nicely. Are you going to post it on Facebook? I'm going to post it on Facebook. Man, that's exciting. My first 360 picture. One of the first things we learned when we got here was that the country is Bosnia and Herzegovina. Right now we are in the southern part in Herzegovina, where Mostar is. And we also learned that Herzegovina, I don't know how to break it down, but it means like king of the wines. Herzeg, 
of vina. Vina, vino. So maybe we should have some wine. But we're debating right now if we should go up to the capital, Sarajevo. And we don't know. As usual, we have nothing booked after tomorrow. <laughs> so maybe I should get on that. All right there, mate. We bloody, we bloody well found them. Found what we were looking for. You know, uh, I'm talking in an Australian accent here. No. Is that, was that an Australian accent, Phil? I don't think so. Guys, if you're thinking of coming to Bo uh, Bosnia, and heard of Herzegovina, you should for one reason only. Like Croatia, there's a lot of cats. Look how he wraps the tail. I think maybe his feet are cold. So we like just stepped out kind of off the old town onto like some main street. There's like nice new buildings and then there's like buildings that look like absolutely destroyed. But the city like there's construction like everywhere. They're like it looks like they're putting in a lot of money to fix like the roads. Construction everywhere. So like maybe in the winter they do the construction and in the summer the tourists come. But like it's interesting. It's such a such contrast. I think another thing worth mentioning is like everyone here that's our age lived through a war, which is something that like is hard for me to even imagine. And so people that we meet are they lived through it. They know people that died and like it's a very heavy thing to to sort of see firsthand and we watched a movie to sort of help us understand on YouTube. It's called unfinished business or something we'll link it below it's like a documentary style but it's like really intense to even be in these places that i don't know so wes why did you bring us to the World College in Mostar. Well, it's a funny story. Our host yesterday, he, one of the things that he told us was that Kim Jong-un went to this college or this university. Kim Jong-un from North Korea, the, the leader, like just like, was it four years ago or something? Like recently, six years ago? Is that, that's cool. It's like a, just a little interesting fact. We're trying to make sense of the scribbles and it looks like we're in like the Spanish square. This main street was the front line in the war and I think that the abandoned building there was like the sniper tower, which is the triangle, we think. And I and, and and I look stupid and and that's it. Oh my God! There it is. There it is, fell. Oh, we found it. We found what we've been looking for, guys. This is the best thing. We've been traveling for a year. This is the best thing you'll ever see in your life. Get ready to be amazed. Felicia does thinks I'm overdoing it. There is a statue of Bruce Lee in. Herzegovina. Why? What? Awesome. Three words. Why, what, and awesome. On the statue, okay, let me explain to you guys. I know the answer to this. I don't know what it says, but it says your Mostar. So that has something to do with Bruce Lee. Or actually, our host didn't even know what it, why it was here. I was, uh, I was really, I think I was more excited about this than you were, Phil. Wes, Felicia, Bruce Lee, Let's end this video. The end of this episode. Next episode, we will be somewhere else. Somewhere else, but somewhere soon. No, not close. We'll be close. And if you guys are curious about Mostar, I hope we've inspired you to come check it out. Yeah, I was actually really impressed. This is a Wes recommendation for a visit. Adios, amigos.
Thank you for watching, and I can still say Havala. High five, Bruce. <sighs> I'm not very good at Kung Fu, but I'm the best at karate.